Chie, are you all right? Chie? She said that red looks good on me. Yukiko-san? I hated my name. Yukiko. Snow. Snow is cold and it melts quickly. It's transient. Worthless. But it's perfect for me. Apart from inheriting the inn, I'm worthless. Still, Chie told me that red looks good on me. Are these Yukiko-san's inner thoughts? I remember hearing Saki-senpai's too. Yeah. This castle is probably here because of this Yukiko person. Yukiko... Chie was the only one who gave my life meaning. She's bright and strong, and she can do anything. She has everything that I don't. Compared to Chie, I'm... I'm... Chie protects me. She looks after my worthless life. And I... I don't deserve any of it. Chie is so kind. Yukiko, uh, I... Chie is so kind, huh? What a joke! W what Oh man, is that... It's just like Yosuke. She lost control of her suppressed self. Now it's a shadow. Are we talking about that, Yukiko? <laughs> she says I'm protecting her. <laughs> she says she's worthless. <laughs> That's how it should be, right? What are you saying? Yukiko's so good-looking, so fair-skinned, so feminine. She's the one all the guys drool over. When Yukiko looked at me with such jealousy, man, did I get a charge out of that. Yukiko knows the score. She can't do anything if I'm not around. I'm better than her. Much, much better. No, I have never thought that. What are we gonna do? We need to protect Chia-chan right now. No, don't come near me. Don't look at me. Chia, calm down. No, no, this isn't me. Wait, stupid. Don't say anything else like that. <laughs> That's right. I'm the one who can't do anything alone. I can't win as a girl, let alone as a person. I'm pathetic. But Yukiko, she depends on me. <laughs> That's why she's my friend. I'll never loosen my grip on her. She's too important to me. No, that is not how I think of her. <laughs> so you're just gonna turn your back and deny me again? But things are different now. When the time comes, I'll be the one left standing. <laughs> you won't mind, right? I'm still you. Shut up! You're... Chie, no! You're not me! Chie! <laughs> <laughs> ah! It's coming! You have to use your powers to save Chie chan!
shadow, the true self. What do you guys think you're doing, trying to defend the real me? Then you're gonna pay the price! Shut up! Quit being such a pain! Chie, just hang in there a little longer! Ha! Think you can stop me that easy? <laughs> Let's go, okay. Persona. Now's our chance. You ready? All right. We've only gotten started. Scream for me! Chie, are you okay? What happened? What's the matter? Got nothing to say anymore? Stop it, Chie. It's all right. But... Everyone? He's right. I went through the same thing. So I can understand. I mean, everyone has a side like this. Yeah, I, I kinda get it now. You are me. A side of me I, I couldn't forgive. That I tried to ignore. But you still exist. You're a part of me. feels that way but but I, I wasn't lying about being friends with Yukiko 
like we didn't know that already. Hey, Chie! I'm okay. Just a little tired. You don't look okay at all. And I bet you can use the same power we have now. Huh? Hey, what should we do? I agree. We need to let Chia rest. I I never said I needed a break. I, I can I can still keep going. Don't overdo it. It's not that we don't think you can. It's just we have to save Yukiko-san no matter what. Now that you have the power, you can fight with us. It'd be much better for us all if you had your strength back. That's why we're saying we should go back and regroup. But Yukiko's still in here, isn't she? I, if those were Yukiko's true feelings, then I have to tell her something. I'm not as strong as she thinks. It's because she was with me. Because we were always together, I was able to act that way. If we weren't, I'd... Well, you need to get your strength back. Then you can tell her. Yuki-chan's normal. The shadows don't attack normal people. They only attack when the fog lifts here. So Yukiko-san will be safe until then, right? I'm positive. Why? I don't get it. Teddy told us that the weather here is the opposite of our own world. When it fogs over in our world, that's the day it lifts here, and that's when the shadows attack their victim. So even if we leave for a while, Yukiko-san won't be in danger until the fog starts to cover Inaba. I'm sure of it. It was the same way for that announcer and senpai. Don't you remember how it was foggy in town on the days they died? You mean they were killed by their other selves? The fog usually appears after it rains. But it's been sunny lately. I don't think it's going to rain anytime soon. Don't worry so much. We'll check the weather forecast first thing when we get back. But I, I can't turn back now. We've come so far. Yukiko's still here. She's all alone. She must be so scared. Then you tell me how much further we gotta go to reach Yukiko-san. Th that's You don't know what's up ahead. The enemies might be even stronger. If we push ourselves too hard and get wiped out, who will save Yukiko-san then? We can't fail, no matter what. Am I wrong? <sighs> All right. I'm, I'm sorry about before. I shouldn't have rushed in like that by myself. No worries. We're definitely gonna save Yukiko-san, right? Right.